Hi there, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to show you how to fix this blue screen of death you might be getting on your machine and it displays the text saying master boot record is corrupt. Hope you find this guide useful. If you do, please help me out by subscribing to my channel. Okay, so when you get this blue screen of death, you will not be able to boot to your desktop. Um, every time you turn on your machine and try to boot to Windows, it will display this uh, blue screen of death. What you need to do is put the Windows 10 install uh, media into your machine, whether that's DVD or USB. If you don't have that, just go to Google, uh, Google Windows 10 ISO, click on this Microsoft link here, and you can download a tool if you just scroll, scroll down. If you click on download tool now, uh, run the tool, and that will help you to create a bootable USB or DVD drive. So put that into your machine and then restart your machine and boot to that media. It will ask you here to press any key. So simply press any key to boot to the media. Okay here, so just select your language and uh, time and currency format. Then click next. Uh, do not click on install now. We need to click on repair your computer in the bottom left. here we need to click on troubleshoot advanced options and then command prompt and we need to type in this command b o o t r e c space forward slash f i x m b r fix master boot record so if you just type that in and then press enter we can see there it was successful so just type in exit hit enter and then click on turn off your pc uh, remove the windows 10 uh, media from your machine and then start up your machine again uh, try and boot to windows hopefully that will fix it because that's just created a new master boot record which will have the correct settings in it uh, if that doesn't work come back into this menu click on troubleshoot advanced options command prompt again next command we should run is chkdsk space c colon space forward slash f space forward slash i what that is going to do is it's going to check the c drive for any corrupt files if it does find corrupt files it'll automatically fix them so again when that's completed if you just type in exit and again turn off your machine try and boot to your desktop uh, that should fix it if it doesn't again come into this menu click on troubleshoot advanced options click on startup repair uh, that is basically going to check all of the startup uh, files for your windows 10 operating system uh, it's going to replace them with fresh uh, files so if there is any configuration issue or possibly some file corruption still, it will fix that. And after you've run that again, restart your machine, boot to the desktop. If you don't, if, if you sorry, if you still get the blue screen of death, come back here. And the very last thing that you can do is reset this PC. Uh, you can select this option here, keep my files. So when you reinstall Windows 10, it's going to keep any personal files you might have, like pictures or Word documents on your desktop, or maybe if you're, you've kept it on somewhere in your C drive. Um, but be aware it will uninstall applications. So for example, if you had like Office on, in there, um, Adobe Reader, WinZip, WinRAR, it will actually remove those applications, but it should keep any personal files that you have. Uh, but use that as a last option. Uh, the other um, fixes that I gave you should work um, but if you do have any um, questions on this post process please post them in a comment below and I'll help you out but thanks for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one